In today's video, I am going to explain the most important problem from functions of a complex variable. So here, in this video, I am going to prove that dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square into the real part of f of z whole square is equal to 2 times of modulus of f dash of z whole square, where w is equal to f of z is analytic. See here one important thing, f of z is analytic means it satisfies the CR equations and also obeys Laplace equations. See, according to the given data, so we have f of z is equal to, this is u plus iv. It's very clear that u is the real part and v is the imaginary part. Therefore, the real part of f of z is equal to u and the imaginary part is nothing but v. And see here, if I make a derivative with respect to x, then f dash of z is equal to, this is dou u by dou x plus i times of, this is dou v by dou x. And see here, it is given that f of z is analytic. See here, in, in the question, it is given that f of z is analytic. Given f of z is analytic, it means that it obeys CR equations. So, f of z satisfies f of z satisfies CR equations. So, as you know that CR equations are nothing but ux is equal to. So, see, see here ux is equal to this is vy and uy is equal to this is minus vx. So, these are the CR equations. So, from this what is vx? That is dou v by dou x is nothing but minus of this is dou u by dou y. So, in place of dou v by dou x, I am going to write minus dou, dou u by dou y. Therefore, our f dash of z, see here, f dash of z is equal to, this is dou u by dou x. In place of dou v by dou x, I am writing minus, this is dou u by dou y. Already there is minus i here, i here. So, this can be written as f dash of z is equal to this is ux minus i times of ui u with respect to x this is dou u by dou y so if i take modulus modulus of f dash of z is nothing but this is root over so this is root over ux square and this is uy square so if i square on both sides sbs so squaring on both sides then modulus of f dash of z whole square is nothing but ux square plus uy square. So, this I am going to consider equation number 1. So, this is equation number 1 and coming to the point here. So, we have to prove that the real part is nothing but u. So, we have to make a double derivative that is dou square by dou x square. So, first of all, we have to take u square. So, now we have dou by dou x of u square is nothing but if i make a derivative with respect to x u square so this will be 2u into dou u by dou x so if again i differentiate with respect to x that is dou square by dou x square into u square so this is u and this is v see what happens here u i'll make a derivative so for u it is dou u by dou x and i'm leaving this dou u by dou x and again now I am leaving this u and for dou u by dou x it will be dou square u by dou x square. Got it? So it's very clear that if I make a double derivative then I am using this uv rule. So here so this will be dou square u by. So dou square by dou x square into u square is equal to 2 times of this is dou u by dou x whole square plus u times of this is dou square u by dou x square and similarly if i make a derivative double derivative with respect to y with respect to y and this will be dou square by dou y square into u square is equal to this is two times of this is dou u by dou y so, if I make a double derivative in place of x, I am writing y. Dou u by dou y whole square plus u times of this is dou square u by. So, this is y square. Dou square u by dou 
y square so this is y square so if i add these two equations see here if i add these two equations addition so this will be do square u square by do x square plus this is do square u square by do y square is equal to two times of if i add these two then see this will be do u by do x whole square and this is do u by do y whole square if i take u common then see if i add these two then this will be do square u by do x square and this is do square u by this is do y square do y square so if we observe properly f of given f of z is analytic again we have to recollect that f of z is analytic if it's analytic it will satisfies the laplace equation therefore f of z satisfies laplace equations laplace equations what are those laplace equations that is del square u is equal to 0 del square u is nothing but do square u by do x square plus do square u by do y square is equal to 0 so if you see properly so do square u by do x square plus do square u by do y square so if you apply so this value is equal to 0 so if i apply this here so if we consider this equation so in this equation if we apply the laplace equation then this equation will become see here that is do square u by do x square plus this is do square u by do y square is equal to two times of if you see here this equation that is do u by do x whole square plus do u by do y whole square plus u times of see here this value is nothing but according to the laplace equation if i substitute this will be zero laplace equation then what remains here then do square u by do x square plus do square u by do y square is equal to 2 times of 2 times of so this can be written as u x square and this is u y square and as we have from equation 1 what is u x square plus u y square from equation 1 it is modulus of f dash of z whole square so from equation 1 we have from equation 1 from equation 1 we have u x square plus u y square is equal to modulus of f dash of z whole square so if i sub substitute here in this equation if i substitute then this will become do square u by do x square plus do square u by do y square is equal to 2 times of in place of u x square plus u y square i am substituting modulus of f dash of z whole square so modulus of f dash of z whole square so this can be written as so here if you see here this is u square this is u square so I forgot to write this is u square u square so if i take do square by do x square plus do square by do y square and this will be u square this is two times of modulus of f of z whole square u is nothing but what is u the real part of f of z u i have mentioned here as a real part of f of z that's what i'm writing here so this is nothing but do square u by do x square plus do square by do y square in place of u i am writing the real part of f of z whole square is equal to 2 times of modulus of f of z whole square and this is how we have to prove see here so what is it it's asked to prove that do square by do x square plus do square by do y square into the modulus of real part of f of z whole square is equal to 2 times of f dash of z whole square so we got the same thing so in place of u square i wrote real part of f of z whole square so it's so simple we have f of z is equal to u plus iv so u is nothing but the real part of u so if i make a derivative with respect to x this is do u by do x plus i into do u by do y since f of z is analytic it satisfies the cr equation in 
in place of dou v by dou x we have minus dou u by dou y so if i substitute the same thing here and took modulus on both sides and after squaring on both sides we got modulus of f dash of z whole square is equal to u x square plus u y square so this equation i mentioned it as one so again we have u square if i make a, a derivative with respect to x for u square this is 2u into do u by do x so if i make a double derivative why should i make a double derivative because in the question it is asked do square u by do x square into real part of f of z real part is nothing but u so do square by do x square so if i make a double derivative then this will be the answer and similarly if i make a double derivative with respect to y and this will be the answer so if i add up these two equations see here at last since f of z is analytic it satisfies the laplace equation according to the laplace equation this whole thing becomes zero so if i substitute zero here then this remains and according to equation one we have in place of ux square plus uy square as modulus of f dash of z whole square so if i substitute the same thing we got the answer and thank you so much for watching if you really like you know what to do please practice and have a look at my next video too and definitely it will be very very helpful for your preparation and please pass it on to your friends as many friends as you can thank you so much